Hello and welcome to another fun part of our lecture. Well, you've seen in the first three sections that ASP uh, uses a uniform problem representation to account for elaboration tolerance. That is it, is, it distinguishes problem instance from problem encoding. Then you've seen the workflow of ASP by looking at graph coloring. And finally, we had a glance at ASP's modeling methodology that roughly relies on first having a generator that provides solution candidates and then a tester that among the solution candidates eliminates all those that are after all no solution. Okay, and now what we will do, we will more or less take these concepts that you've seen before and we will explore them in the context of five case studies. And believe me, it'll be fun.